Hello, in this episode, let's learn how to change the data type in our forms. Let's begin by preparing the right data type. In this case, I want my company data to hold a certain value. I have changed the data type to enum so that we can add multiple values that can be selected from. In this case, I have put company A and B. And we can have a look in our preview, there's company A and B for selection. But let's say you want only to return a single value. Let's change it back to text. An initial value. We Let's add in this case company A. Let's not forget the inverted commas. Now the value company A displays when we create a new entry. Let's do the rest. So I'm just going to put the rest of the values for each column. So in this case division. So you can see A, B, C for division. I'm going to do the same for department let's say I put here department 1 and 2 now here's an interesting part I want to capture the information as to who added this record so in updated by in initial value let's add user email so by doing this we will capture the email address of the person who is logged in and using the app in updated on, I would like to capture the date and time. So let's change the data type to date and time. And initial value, let's add now. This helps us to capture the date and time. So as a result, we'll get to see all of the information that we have added in the form as follows and of course the user email and when the record has been updated or inserted has been displayed in the form as well well i hope you enjoyed this video see you guys in the next one aris here signing out